Last time on Dragon Ball Z, our heroes faced off in their climactic battle atop the Tower of Gears, Gasparost, and now they make their way back to Dongress to celebrate. And hey guys, this is Getsumara, and we're playing more Tales of Asperia. How climactic, we just had an awesome, awesome last episode, and this episode is going to be even more awesome, but uh, shit, I went the wrong way, you can't get into Dongress this way, I don't think. No, you can't. Balls. Balls, balls, balls. God damn it. Stupid narrator. Thinking this is Dragon Ball Z, making me get lost. Thank God I got a holy bottle on. And good news, everyone. This episode has me drinking coffee. Yay! Look! The knights have come back! I'm innocent, I tell you! This is a plot by the knights to destroy the council! Bullshit! You're corrupt and you know it, just fucking die. He doesn't know when to quit, does he? Where's Flynn? I can't make him out from here. Well, we can't make him out, so let's go see <clears throat> Barbos. Maybe kick him in the taint or something as we walk by. You know, the good stuff. You must not be taken in by the knights! They only plan to crush this town once you've all been lured into a false sense of safety. On the honor of the Imperial Knights, I swear that we would never perpetrate such disloyalty. You're... Flynn Shifo. The Empire and the Union have joined in a treaty of friendship. What? Impossible. At this moment, Don Whitehorse and His Highness Yoder are in council together. It's only a matter of time until it's made official. But how? I thought that cursed Alexei was tied up in other matters. Yes. It is true that our Commandant could only make a brief appearance before returning to the capital. Then, on whose authority? No! This can't mean my plans have been ruined by this... this boy! This will put an end to the suffering of the people of Capua Nor as well. Here's hoping the next Magistrate they get is more of a stand-up guy. I will do what I can to make sure a worthy person is chosen when I get back to the castle. To the castle? You mean you're going back to the capital, Estelle? Yes. With Rago gone, the rest of the castle should have returned to normal. But you don't really want to go back. Well, what do you mean? I can see it in your face. No, I... Well, you should do what suits you best. You've made up your own mind, right? I will go back. I don't want Flynn or anyone else to have to worry about me anymore. Well, that's for sure. You're a lot of excess baggage. It's gonna be lonely with that, or won't it, Rapide? Of course, Rapide doesn't care, so well... Let's just have some fun. Now, let's go to the inn, because we're tired, apparently. Oh man, it's been such a long day. Killing Barbos, watching Rago get arrested. Man, this is like winning the lottery. 400 gold? Go fuck yourself, I'm not staying with you. I'm just gonna sleep here and just gonna have some fun. It's full of equipment. Why can't we have it then? Come on, give me the equipment, I want it. Come on. Fine. I think you're so hot, Mr. Innkeeper. Remember in Golden Sun, it was like 20 coins to save the night, now it's 400 gold. I may have like a million gold, but this is still atrocious! Yuri! It's terrible! Oh man, just let me sleep. Rago! He, he... What did Rago do? They say he used his standing in the council to reduce his charges! It looks like he's gonna get off with only a minor drop in rank, after everything he did! This has got to be a joke. It's not a joke! It's the truth! So this is how the Empire works now, huh? Damn it, this is not funny. What do we do, Yuri? Hmm. I don't know. How can he not get punished? Wait, if we tell Estelle, maybe she can do something about it. Hey, don't go giving the princess too much trouble. Damn it, what's Flynn doing anyway? 
I wonder if he's at his post right now. Doesn't anyone knock anymore? You knew I'd be coming. That oh my, looks like somebody got a promotion. As of today, I've been assigned the post of captain. So, the birth of the Flynn Brigade, huh? Looks like I've been one-upped again. If that's how you feel, you should come back to the Knights. You'd be able to... Don't waste your breath. Congratulations on making captain. Thank you. You didn't come down here to celebrate my promotion. No, I didn't. It's Rago, isn't it? Appropriating Nor Harbor for his own purposes? Committing treason by his collusion with Barbos? Add to this stealing from the populace and the extermination of even his own people simply because he didn't like them. The people he killed were either fed to monsters or sold to those who will pay money for corpses. Sick bastard. That he should be able to do those things and not have to answer for them. The authority of the council is far more powerful than I'd imagined. I thought with this promotion to captain that I'd gotten a bit closer to my goal. But I have to face the fact that the law can't even punish a single person like Rago. You know it doesn't end here. You'll climb even higher until you can make the right changes. True. But many people will continue to suffer in the meantime, needlessly. When I consider that, I... Don't go flying off the handle and smacking him around. The progress you made would all be for nothing. <clears throat> if he's above you, you go even higher, and then... Yes. Someday I'll create a legal order that treats everyone with equality. I have to. Good. And I'll do things my own way. Yuri? How would you go about punishing the villains that the law can't touch? I'm still trying to figure that out. It seems I may have gotten a little careless when I thought Alexei wouldn't be around. Flynn Shifo, that impertinent upstart. This is a grudge I won't soon forget. I will bring down the full authority of the Council on you. Ah! What the? It's you. Do you intend to harm me? I'm a member of the Council, you know. I could crush you w with a single command. You won't get away with this. The laws and the council may have let you go, but I'm afraid I can't do that. Ah, st stay back! <laughs> oh, I was so close. Day nomos. Yuri's eyes were just so badass there, it's so awesome. Also, bitch got what he had coming! Yeah! Repeat. Yuri, you're in the title. Vigilante! Hooray! And repeat in the title, Sinful Sidekick. It's too bad we gotta split up. Please, come visit the castle anytime. He'll really come if you say that. What? Didn't she just invite me? Nobody wants a useless kid around the castle, especially to a princess. Huh. Idiot. With the treaty, it'll become easier for guild members to enter the capital. That's right. Princess, we should be going. Oh, yes. 
I promise to do what I can about Rago to see that he gets the punishment he deserves. Princess, you should know. What? You see, Lord Rago has not been seen since last night. We do not yet know the details. His whereabouts are being investigated as we speak. What could this mean? Maybe he got scared and ran away. Well, I guess I'll be going too. I want to check out stuff like those air clinic. When I finish my analysis, I'll um pay a visit to the capital too. Of course you will. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, okay then. See ya. And Carol, where will you go from here? I want to start up a guild with Yuri. That sounds like a good idea. Your Highness. Sorry, I'm ready now. Shouldn't I go get Yuri? No. I wouldn't want to wake him. All right. Well, this is it. Yeah, I hope we see each other again. Yuri, are you awake? Ugh, man, I slept like a log last night. Nothing like killing a council member to give you a good sleep at night. Ugh. Estelle and Rita already took off. Oh. If you hurry, you might still be able to catch her. I can meet them anytime I want. Jeez, Yuri. Fine, if that's how you're gonna be. Somebody turned to the wrong side of the bed, then decided to get up for once? Even if I did go, it would just make it harder for them to leave. What the? Uh-oh. What the hell's going on? Monsters. Yuri! Carol, any idea what that thing is? No. I've never seen anything like that before. It's coming down! Ah! Monster! Carol leaves the party. Come on, Carol. What? Hey, wait! I was trying to leave the party. What are you doing? Well, at least now he's in our party, so he can leave it just after. Just when I get to relax, I get dragged into another mess. Yuri, fate really is out to get you. Hey, it's not all my fault. You had a role in this, too. But I never ran into gigantic monsters or got arrested by knights before I met you. Well, things didn't go bad for me until I left the capital with Estelle. So that means... Drop it. Keep moving. Right. Ah oh, man, I love looking at his terrified face in HD. And haha, this guard died. Oh, he's just knocked out. Fine, don't die. Is going on here? Yuri, protect her highness. Yuri, look. This way, fell fiend. Why is it just ignoring us? Oh yeah, because if you're gonna melee attack something, it's gonna be a flying monster that you can't even touch. Great move, Sodia. can do <laughs> you expect me to stand by while that thing makes a snack out of Estelle the insipid poison of this world must be purged it can speak who who are you Yuri you're safe Continue my journey. What do you mean? If 
you're going back to the capital, you shouldn't keep Flynn waiting. It's for you to decide. Then I... I want to continue the journey as well. Now that's what I wanted to hear. Judas? Don't! It's too dangerous! Look who's talking. I'll be fine. You go on ahead. Come on, quickly! My, you're a stubborn one. Huh? Why is it taking off? Yuri! Lady Estelise! Wait! Here comes the cavalry. I'm sorry, Flynn. I realize now I can't just go back to the capital. There are too many things I still need to know. Surely after returning to the capital, you can... The voices of the people suffering in Nora Harbor never reached the capital. I won't achieve anything if I'm not willing to approach these problems head on. I've come to realize that during my travels. That's why. That's why I have to keep going. Your Highness! Flynn, get this court back to the lower quarter. Oh crap, I dropped it! Psh! Oh god, now we're broke. I won't be going back to the capital anytime soon. I'm going to start up a guild. Give my regards to Hanks and everyone else. Yuri! A guild? So that's what you meant by doing things your own way. No, it meant he's gonna go kill Rago, but I suppose this works out too. Yeah, I finally made up my mind. That's fine, but what about Princess? Take care, Flynn. Yuri! I suppose I should have talked to you first, but here's to our new guild, Carol. Right! Alright, let's go. If we hang around here much longer, some of those knights are bound to come after us. Estelle earned the Seeker of Truth title! Hooray! And we got Judith in our party, and Estelle. And we handed over the Aqua Blast to your core. High fives all around, that was just an awesome scene. Yeah, I told you there'd be another awesome episode coming. That huge flying monster actually talked, right? You ever heard of a monster like that? I've never seen or heard of anything like that. I don't think anybody in the Hunting Blades has. Man, first that thing in Karabakram, and now this. The world's just full of surprises. I don't care how many lives you have, it wouldn't be enough to fight that thing. Yeah, not even I feel like taking on a monster like that. Just like Eternal Sonata, we had ourselves a cutscene episode, now that was fun. So next time on Let's Play Tales of Asperia, we will just go explore now, because we don't know where we want to go. So, see you next time, goodbye!